What is going on, Hustlers? Welcome back into Hustlepedia. Today, I want to dive into Chain Guardians, a project that has been in my portfolio for quite a while, but I wanted to go over this project because it is a very hot project, and in terms of everything that it's doing, its developments it has coming up in its actual game, the fact that it has a live play-to-earn game out right now uh, that you can get into, it is Basically, blockchain meets superheroes as they advertise it, a decentralized sci-fi and anime-inspired gaming universe. We'll get into Chain Guardians, we'll look at the gameplay, we'll take a look at the trailer, the community behind Chain Guardians, and then the functionality behind Chain Guardians. Not only their NFT platform within the game, the marketplace, the NFT farming, the NFT mining aspect, uh, we'll get into obviously the characters. Uh, basically what sets them apart from other play to earn games so far the team behind the project as well as their live games right now and their launch pad platform there's so much to be bullish about in my opinion when it comes down to chain guardians and we're going to get into this video exactly why i love this project uh, and i think it's a good time to cover it as it's sitting at a dollar and two cents 35 million dollar market cap right now and if you look at all time highs this coin became uh, it came on to uh, coin market cap in March. And as you see here, all time highs were up in the four, right above $4 is where this candle hit. So we will take a look at Chain Guardians in this video, top to bottom, and why I love this project. If you are new to the channel, be sure to drop down and hit the subscribe button. We come out with brand new cryptocurrency and crypto gaming videos here every single day on the channel, as well as altcoin videos uh, to keep you updated on exactly what we are investing in and what we are looking at for our portfolios. And I am not a financial advisor. I just like sharing exactly what I am looking at for my portfolio, whether it be my DeFi stack, whether it be my blue chips, whether it be my crypto gaming. I like to let everyone know what I'm looking at and exactly why I am bullish on certain projects. Uh, and like the video if you enjoyed the video, if you are bullish on crypto gaming and Chain Guardians. So what is Chain Guardians? It is positioning itself as the first ecosystem that combines blockchain and superheroes, a platform that combines traditional gaming concepts with blockchain technologies to enable player-driven economies. Through the Chain Guardians ecosystem, you are able to participate in the free-to-play NFT mining platform and role-playing game. This allows players to earn income, turning the time and energy they spend into tangible rewards. So you are working towards these NFT characters and these NFT rewards via Chain Guardians inside of the ecosystem. And there's so many different ways that you can go about uh, you know, your NFTs. You can either utilize them in battles or you can flip them in the marketplace. So a lot of options there. The platform uses its own Chain Guardian credits, CGC token, and there are two ways to earn it. Uh, one is by staking any NFTs that have been added to the NFT mining game. If the user wins the block reward, they are credited with CGC, which can be converted into the Chain Guardian token, CGG, which is the governance token. And then another way to earn the in-game currency is by playing the role-playing game itself. Uh, so that is pretty straightforward. It's play to earn, but with an NFT mining aspect. So any NFTs you earn, you can put into that basically an NFT mining game and you can win that block reward uh, and win those tokens or even other NFTs. So that is awesome to see. And the Chain Guardians game is controlled by the player and is a real-time battle-based game. When you're offline, advanced AI-based battles will take place that are governed by Guardians attributes. And in the game, players can strategically conquer castles, fortresses, and dungeons. The players are also able to ambush enemies. And the game's main purpose is to loot and eradicate the enemies. So at its core, it's a trading card NFT RPG battle based game and I want to show you exactly what this game looks like from a trailer standpoint um, I absolutely love this project guys From the gameplay to everything else that it has going on as you get set in 2073 um, And a lot of these players are based on different blockchains like there's a Binance character for example and it's very obvious they have finance shields and finance shoulder pads, like like armor. Um, so this is kind of the animations look top notch. They are coming out with a 3D development in their game very soon. A lot of 3D upgrades in the Chain Guardians game. But right now, guys, this game is playable. You can literally play this game right now on your computer on ChainGuardians.io. Play to earn PVE PVP game, world's first NFT mining platform. Player driven economy, the marketplace there, obviously. Interoperable digital collections. 
and it looks pretty straightforward. It looks mobile appish, you know. It looks like a battle-based, strategy-based character, you know, turn-based battle game. It was kind of like a trading card meets the blockchain meets superheroes type of game, as you see here, blockchain meets superheroes, stake, play, and earn. So let's take a look at Chain Guardians, a decentralized sci-fi and anime inspired gaming universe what is chain guardians blockchain game where you play to earn you get started for free and collect nfts in an ecosystem underpinned by state-of-the-art blockchain technologies it is the world's first ecosystem where blockchain meets superheroes and this project was developed in 2019 guys that's when the development started uh, so they can definitely pride themselves on that if they would like to i know a lot of projects out there now have superheroes incorporated this project was started in 2019, uh, the development, so they definitely have a claim to that first ecosystem where blockchain meets superheroes. And then you take a look, blockchain superhero fighting, esports ready for team competitions, that's awesome, they're encouraging esports in this play to earn economy, competitive tournaments and battle to earn. NFT mining game where you can partner with major, they are partnered with major NFT projects where you stake your NFTs to earn. Very straightforward. You can use your characters uh, in a staking, a mining game basically, and you are staking your NFTs to earn more NFTs or the in game currency. And Cryptoverse role playing game, the play to earn RPG is enabled for browser and mobile and is imp uh, it involves interoperable NFT assets and as you see, play for free. The ongoing events is the Chainlink VRF, so you can generate your own character, minting process utilizing Chainlink's verifiable randomness functionality. I also have mixing Mixies World and Portal Your Chain Guardians NFTs Cross Chain. So in the Mixies World, also participate in pancake swap syrup pools on the Chain Guardians NFT platform to find a mix tokens. Once you've cooked up enough mix tokens, you can redeem them for a limited edition mixy collectible nft so they have a lot of ongoing stuff a lot of the time as well like this is pretty consistent with other blockchains other platforms as you see working with chain link working with pancake swap so they have a lot of legitimate partnerships and that is another thing we'll get into in a second they also have a guardian program it's like a rewards program uh where not only you can uh, you show your loyalties, like a referral program, everything towards the ecosystem here for your loyalty and engagement. So that's awesome to see. And then you can get a taste of these characters, guys. You have a legendary BitC here. Um, and obviously coin type is Bitcoin, legendary uniqueness. Coin type is Ethereum for Seth Buter, and it is legendary. Coin type is Dash for Dasha. Litecoin, Lolita Lee. Binancio for Binance. And this is why it's Chain Guardians. It is the guardians of each blockchain. The uh, Polygon. So I really like that concept and I really like the roadmap, the team behind this project. You can take a look at their team. They are uh, doxed in terms of public. You can look up each of their CEO, their COO, and the CTO. Very solid team with a great, great vision on exactly what they're trying to capitalize. Ever since the arrival of an unknown entity from outer space, worlds have been destroyed, oppressed, and abused. It wasn't until Bitsy underwent a metamorphosis that this faced any type of resistance. Now, four years on, guardians across the cryptoverse have formed alliances to rival, uh, to rival and fight back. Below are some of the prominent members of the Guardian Council. Uh, we already took a look at these characters. These are all the NFTs. Uh, the NFT characters and the, and the trading cards that you can collect. And obviously, these are the legendary versions. I'm sure that there are like lower versions as well inside of the game. And then you take a look at their early supporters, Moon Whale, uh, Animoca Brands. Everything that Animoca Brands does usually turns to something great. I'm just going to throw that out there. Animoca Brands has their hands in a lot of very, very successful projects across crypto gaming. And do your own research, but I'm very bullish on that. And then their Cryptoverse alliances with other projects. And then you take a look, enter the Cryptoverse. You can go ahead and enroll in the ranks and fight against the Gatekeeper Tyrant in their RPG play to earn game. You can start NFT mining as well. Uh, and if you need to start with an NFT, you can hit the OpenSea Marketplace and find the Chain Guardians NFTs. And they also have the role playing game right here, downloadable for a browser. And you can also pick up characters for that. And I also wanted to get into their tech integration and business development, guys, with Chainlink, OpenSea, Netvark, Orion, Elrond, Decentraland, and Polygon. 
basically every major player in crypto gaming and around the blockchain for interoperability as far as an oracle nfts netvark for the metaverse decentraland for the metaverse or orion polygon elrond really all they're missing here is paul is uh not, not polygon engine or sandbox so and really decentraland and polygon take care of those two as far as operability i mean i'm super bullish on these partnerships and you know being partnered with such major players in the nft gaming space is a super bullish thing like decentraland polygon netvark these are huge partnerships and this is a huge project that also guys a perk for holding the chain guardians token is they do have nft and DeFi focused incubator and boost pad uh, where it is centered upon nft and DeFi projects uh, so you can use boost score chain analysis and highlight uh, reward desirable behaviors governance powered protocol and ecosystem and ticketing system allocated allocation probability determined through compounding desirable behaviors and user boost score so your boost score in the uh, launch pad will help your allocation as you see some of their upcoming projects here and I want to go, do they have the completed? Yes, they do. As you see here, IDO for Engine Starter, Crypto Blades, Netvark. Uh, this was an NFT sale, Polka Fantasy. So guys, they have had a lot of, like the Netvark land sale here on, cha on Chain Boost really was big. And there will be a lot of projects coming up. These three here, Polka Fantasy, Blockchain Monster Hunt, and Chain Bunnies. These are just some of the they just did cryo war cryo war has gotten a lot of publicity so guys a lot going on with chain guardians a lot of perks to be able to get involved in not only their game not only their nft mining platform but you will be able to get involved in these launch pad platforms and these launches right here on their boost pad to be able to get involved with these gaming projects right on IGO or initial NFT offering. As you see, these are all NFT sales. So these are like land sales. These are character sales, stuff like that. Um, so this incubator and this launch pad is super unique on chain boost and overall guys I am super super bullish on chain guardians with the updates coming to the game more projects flooding into the IGO space and more projects launching in general the success of the launches on the launch pad for chain guardians and just everything to come with their game I love their vision I love their team the updates that they provide the community everything about this project I'm super bullish on and I have some Chain Guardians in my bag for this bull run and the upcoming adoption of crypto gaming. But I'm not an investment advisor. I am just showing you exactly projects that I am looking at, projects that I am bullish on. And at a market cap of $35 million, this definitely has potential to run up a bit in the Q4 bull run. It's number 659 here on CoinMarketCap at $1.02. All-time highs back in March right after its IDO. As we saw a bunch of pullback here a little bit of a pump here and now we are back in these levels i think is a good entry point for chain guardians i am very bullish on this project but let me know your thoughts down below on chain guardians uh do you really like this project are you bullish on chain guardians crypto gaming in general let me know down below in the comments like the video if you enjoyed uh, have a good morning or night wherever you are watching stay bullish keep hustling peace